Hi everyone, it's your boy Zach and um, just waiting for the oven to heat up so I can make a pizza. So it's like, how do I kill 10 minutes until that happens? And it's like, oh yeah, I'll just review this uh, Jenny Sparks that I read earlier today. I got, <coughs> I got sick yesterday, I was really sick basically all of today, but now suddenly I'm feeling better watching that Tomb Raider movie from 2018. It's good. It seems uh, like the type of movie I would watch on a plane. Like, uh, it's it's specifically like that level of quality where it just kind of just kind of barely keeps you interested, but it's pleasant enough, I'd say. So, um, oh, and I don't have anything to sell right now. There are no active uh, crowdfunding campaigns because I'm getting books out, about to uh, uh, pay the invoice for wave four of the Jawbreakers first kill fulfillment. And uh, Ironsides 3, um, uh, I in the last video I asked for people to, thank you, by the way. <laughs> I just said thank you and then I always remember that thing where that drill instructor said, uh, never say thank you or uh, sorry. Uh, so, sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I said thank you, drill instructor from the year 2000. Um, but um, I was talking about how I was in a quandary because the book is Iron Sights 3, but the subtitle is One Good Dog. And so <coughs> the, uh, <coughs> the solution I'm going with was a suggestion was to call it Iron Sights One Good Dog, but then on the spine, say Iron Sights 3. So I think that's what I... I'm gonna go with um, but this is Jenny Sparks uh, issue three and um, can somebody help Tom he seems a little lost <laughs> um, I have reviewed a lot of uh, Tom King comics over the uh, the years um, and uh, weirdly enough like recently I've kind of unclenched about him because here's the deal about Tom King Tom King you know everyone says Oh, he wants to be Alan Moore. I don't really think so. He just wants to be Tom King, and he's very unapologetic about it. It's a bunch of mommies and weak men over and over and over again. That's his, apparently that's his life, and that's what he wants to write about. So in the uh, the year of our Lord, 2024, getting bothered with Tom King for being Tom King seems like a waste of time. I actually did have... I forget what was so funny, but I think the second issue, there was just like just goofy ass humor that I was kind of into. That all disappears. Um, and uh, I, uh, I struggled my way through this. And then I went to go check the, uh, the comments section on this pirate site, which are quite lively. I really enjoy them. And just everyone was like, <laughs> what the fuck is this? Okay. Okay, so I'm not the only one. So there's been uh, Captain Adam. He's a villain, and he's taken this uh, bar full of uh, soulful saints, essentially, hostage. But we're also going to go back to Baghdad in 2004 because Jenny Sparks, the spirit of the 20th century, was awakened by 9-11. And uh, now she's operating out of uh, Baghdad, which I am very very excited about going back there not anytime soon i got a bunch of stuff to wrap up just in case i get my head chopped off when i go there <laughs> um, but i want to be all caught up on everything all of my books out but um apparently there is a vibrant tourist uh tourism there and safe too uh so that's crazy to me um uh but the funny thing is like the war i mean officially it ended like I think like 10 years ago but the the when it was really going on was like 15 to 20 years ago so I kind of ask like oh aren't they really angry but it's like they're like ah that was like 20 years ago also there's been a lot of wars there also it's kind of interesting <laughs> like we kind of missed you Americans so um uh yeah I've I've seen a bunch of travel blogs about people going there and everything's fine there is tourism in Afghanistan, and that is not going well. It's, yeah, it's, predictably, it's not going well. But, uh, yeah, Iraq is, is, is fine. Um, but anyway, so Superman is there, and 
it's just a whole issue of like half ideas like what if jenny sparks was in iraq at the same time i was that's tom king saying that and like what if superman was there and she's like aren't you going to save people and he's like i can't because of reasons it's like <sighs> well you know the deal with ideas is eventually you have to make them reality and then you end up with this which is just like i said a bunch of half ideas um so uh, it's a hostage situation, and in previous issues, Captain Adam has killed people and then brought them back and healed sick people. So the hostages are basically warming up to him, I guess uh, Stockholm Syndrome-esque. Uh, but um, yeah, it's just yeah, it's just not fully formed to the point where uh, just the whole the whole comment section is just like. Are you okay? <laughs> is this is this your final draft? Well, I guess the print version or the uh, digital version is the final draft. But yeah, uh, can somebody help out uh, Tom? He's 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 having some trouble. Um, it's funny after those those years of the uh, the grilled cheese boobs, which we're seeing in that um, Tomb Raider cartoon right now. Now they're bringing back like actual boobs, and you're realizing that it's this the superman symbol is just really getting its ass kicked by her tits like it's it's just it's just struggling struggling it's just it's so much warping it's kind of going in and being a little bit hidden right there by the cleavage and then going out and going around it's 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 uh it's exhausted uh, but uh, anyway, uh, I can't recommend uh, Jenny Sparks even for Tom King fans. Uh, it's just half baked, uh, unlike my uh, pizza, which is about to be fully baked. That honestly, I'm not even being sarcastic. That might be the best segue I've ever done in the history of this channel. Anyway, thanks for watching.